Inadequate caloric deficit. Weight loss primarily depends on consuming fewer calories than you burn. If you're not in a consistent caloric deficit, you may not lose weight. Overestimating calories burned. Overestimating the calories burned during exercise is a common mistake. People often compensate by eating more than they should, negating their workout efforts. Inconsistent exercise. Irregular exercise patterns can hinder weight loss progress. Consistency is key, and sporadic workouts may not yield desired results. Unhealthy eating habits. Poor dietary choices, such as excessive consumption of processed foods, sugary drinks, or large portions, can offset exercise efforts. Lack of sleep. Inadequate sleep can disrupt hormones that regulate appetite, leading to increased food cravings and overeating. Stress and cortisol. Chronic stress can elevate cortisol levels, which may promote fat retention, especially around the abdominal area. Dehydration. Dehydration can be mistaken for hunger, leading to unnecessary calorie consumption. Staying adequately hydrated is crucial for weight loss. Undereating. Paradoxically, not consuming enough calories can slow down metabolism and hinder weight loss progress. It's essential to find the right balance between a caloric deficit and adequate nutrition. Medical conditions. Some medical conditions, such as thyroid disorders or hormonal imbalances, can affect metabolism and make weight loss more challenging. Plateauing. Weight loss may stall after initial progress due to the body adapting to changes. Introducing new exercises, varying intensity, or adjusting caloric intake may help break through plateaus. It's crucial to remember that weight loss isn't the only indicator of fitness progress. Body composition, muscle gain, and improvements in overall health and fitness are equally important. If weight loss isn't occurring as expected, consulting a healthcare professional or a registered dietitian can provide valuable insights and guidance tailored to individual circumstances.